Hey y'all, it's Dorothy from PreppingYourStep.com and today is my last possible day to film this video and because so many of y'all have been requesting it, hey y'all, it's Dorothy from PreppingYourStep.com and today is my last possible day to film this video and because so many of y'all have been requesting it, I decided to just break this into two parts and film it for y'all but this is my apartment haul. So I am living in an apartment as a lot of y'all may know and I will have my own bedroom and then we have a shared living room and kitchen space and I share a bathroom with one other girl and then we have two other roommates on the other side. So there's four of us total but this is going to be my like storage and desk decor sort of section and then the next video you'll see on Thursday is going to be my bedding and like room decor. So I'm not showing y'all everything because we split up a lot of the stuff like kitchen stuff is what I'm bringing and someone else is bringing a coffee table and someone else is bringing a futon so I'm bringing like mix master, food processor, all that sort of stuff, dishes but I'm not going to show y'all that and I'm not showing y'all my clothes because I feel like that would be kind of boring so this is going to be kind of jumbled just because everything is kind of boxed up already but I wanted to show y'all anyway because I do leave for school tomorrow or when you're watching this I will already be at school so here are the first things that I'll show you I have these like white cabinet sort of things that have boxes in them for bookshelves and I have two of those so I went ahead and got a bunch of these storage bins from Target and they're navy which will match my room and these are just compatible with the 11 inch cube organizer I have and I got eight of them because I think my thing has a total of 12 pockets so I thought it was fine to leave some open on each. For our bathroom, I went ahead and got this shower caddy with chrome finish for my roommate and I in our shower. So I got this from TJ Maxx because I liked this one best after looking around. And I can put my stuff here, my roommate can put her stuff here, and then we can hang stuff at the bottom. Or we can like switch it. It doesn't really make a difference to me. But I figured this was useful to have because girls have lots of bath products. So may as well keep it organized. Another storage bin that I got from Target is for my desk, which I don't understand this year. Our desk don't have drawers, which is really random, but I got these little half storage bins so that I can have my own sort of drawers because I don't know how I'd store stuff if there's not like an actual pull-out drawer. So this kind of fixes that. And when I do like a desk tour for my apartment, you'll be able to see these in action. But I just got three of these in this like tan color. Next, I guess this should technically go in the next video, but I'll go ahead and show you all this. This is for the living room. I did some of the living room art and we got this home sweet apartment print from Lulu in Georgia. And then we have these four state prints. So each of us are from a different state and so those are going to go around this above our couch. My mom found this super cute bin at maybe an estate sale or some antique place and she knew it would match my room so she got it for me. I don't know what exactly I'll use it for but it's really cute and vintage. And so I know it'll definitely find a home on my desk or on my bedside table. And right now it just stores receipts from some of the purchases we've made. Then another decor thing that I should technically show later, but I'll go ahead and show now, is this really cute Evelyn Henson print that says Be an Adventure with all these different tags on it. I'm doing a small gallery wall above my desk, so this is going to look really cute there. For the one drawer that my desk does have, I have this container that I've used the past two years which needs a good Clorox wipe down, so maybe I'll do that next. Um, and it's just great for makeup, so I put like longer things in the middle and then smaller things on the side, and it's just really nice to have, and it keeps your makeup organized. So this will work in the one drawer that my desk does have. Next, I just got this three pack of four by six picture frames, and they're just white, and they're from Target, and I've had these in the past, and they work really great. You can hang them up, or you can like open this stand and display some pictures. Then when I was in Nashville visiting my friends and going on my pledge class little trip, I stopped by the container store and got a few different little acrylic containers. So this doesn't have a name, but it just has a lid and I plan to use this for little cotton rounds, either on my desk or in this like above the shelf dresser thing I have. Um, so that'll be cute for that. So this is kind of random, but it kind of sparked how I wanted to design my room this year. My mom collects these little, they're KLM houses, so from an airline, and they have the free gift when you sit in first class, and they usually have alcohol in them, and a couple of these still do. I'm sure it's disgusting because most of these are old, but I'm going to either line these on my desk or on my dresser somewhere because they are just so cute, and I have like six or seven of them 
that will have a fun, unique, kind of quirky touch to my room. Okay, more from the container store because everything is in boxes, like I mentioned, and I'm unpacking it to repack it, which is ridiculous, but I wanted to show you all. So the next one I got is very similar to the cotton round container, and it just is going to hold q-tips, and I went ahead and packed some in there. Next up is this pencil cup from the container store, and I actually already have one of these, and I use it for my makeup brushes, and it has my monogram on it, but I'm going to use this one for pens or pencils, and I think it'll look really nice having a lot of my stuff acrylic and matching. Next up, because I'm kind of ridiculous, and I decided that once I started matching stuff, why not match everything, I got this really cute acrylic tape dispenser for my desk, and I also got an acrylic stapler. So these were cheap little purchases. I think they'll look good displayed on my desk. Next is this acrylic magazine holder. I put notebooks in this and textbooks. So I have another one at school and I went ahead and grabbed another one from Target. And then I also have this like vanity organizer that's white and it is from Joss and Main, which is like an online home decor site. And then I also packed in that a 4x4 picture frame for my bedside table. So moving on to more of the stuff, this is just kind of like random desk stuff. I'm not going to get everything out because a lot of it is just like school supplies. I did get some cotton rounds. I'm not going to show you all my bathroom stuff, but I just put those in this box. I have some command strips, some push pins, an extension cord, this cute little tassel thing that I'm actually going to hang down the side of my um, full length mirror. Two really pretty pieces of pottery. This is actually from a girl locally, but she has a site. It's called Caroline Real Ceramics. I'm in love with all of her stuff. It's beautiful. But I have this little ring dish, and I also have like a bigger dish of hers. And the rest of the stuff in that box is just like filler paper and random little things like that that I don't think y'all would actually enjoy. So I think that's going to be it for my storage stuff. So stay tuned for Thursday. I'm sorry if this video wasn't as exciting as you thought it would be. I promise I'll be showing you all my apartment once I'm all moved in and I can do a desk tour and that sort of thing and show you each little piece in action when I arrive at school. But if you loved this video, then give it a thumbs up and be sure to subscribe and be on the lookout for Thursday's video with my apartment haul that is more bedding and decor stuff. So I'll talk to you all later. Bye.